All right, what is going on, guys? Um, I want to talk about Arch Oil and all the products that they have. Um, in case you know you were wondering, uh, I'm sure a lot of you guys, if you've seen Arch Oil, you've seen it through uh, Power Stroke Help. That's how I found out about Arch Oil. Um, it's on the forums and stuff now, people using it. But in case you wanted to have you know some experience with someone that uses it in their truck, you know I'll try to you know give you guys uh, my opinions on it. Um, now, when I originally bought my truck, I don't believe the guy that I bought it from ever used any of this. Um, the injectors are pretty strong in my truck. I only have a hundred. I bought it with a hundred seven thousand miles, so it was pretty low miles. But um, I don't think he had used anything. But like I said, the injectors are pretty strong. Um, I don't hear like a skip or anything. Um, but I was like, whatever, you know, going by what Bill says. Um, you know, power stroke help. I was like, you know, I'm gonna use the Arch Oil. Seems like there's a lot of benefits. You know, I'm just gonna run it. So I've been using the AR9100. This is what goes into your oil. Uh, and then I also use the AR6200. This is like a fuel additive. Um, and I'll be honest, I, I mean, I can't really say whether it helps the truck a lot or it helps really at all. Um, because I've used it literally since day two of owning a truck. I bought it. Um, I literally bought the arch oil, bought everything before I even bought the trucks. I knew I was buying it. Um, so, well, I bought it and then it, it was like two weeks where I was able to get the truck. That's what it was. So I literally bought the stuff before I even drove the truck. Uh, I maybe put 10 miles, 15 miles on the truck, uh, without the arch oil. So I've been using it since day one. Uh, the truck is running really good, but what, how I know the arch oil works pretty good is from the most recent product that they came out with. Um, they came out with the um, fuel system cleaner um, recently, like a month ago. He was giving it out for free on his website. I was like, all right, whatever, I'll pay you the shipping handle and get it for free. I put up my truck, you know, seemed like it was driving the same, whatever. Um, nothing really changed. But the one day, I swear to God, it was, it was really weird. I was driving home from someone's house, and as I'm driving, I'm like, man, this truck just feels like it's riding like a lot better. Like it just feels like it's running, like just running like really good. And I couldn't figure out why. And then it, it was, so I started like just running good. Well, I'm like, next couple days, I'm like, man, I'm like this truck just seems like different. Like why is it running? Like it seems like it's running better. I couldn't figure out what it was. And I remembered. I was like, wait a minute. I put the fuel cleaner in there. And uh, I'm telling you, that fuel cleaner, the additive that they just came out with, really helped my truck a lot. I don't know. I noticed a difference in it. Um, I haven't really noticed any fuel economy gains, maybe ever so slightly. I haven't really noticed any type of gains. Um, but I'll tell you what, it made my truck run better. Uh, it just seems like crisper. It seems I have a little bit more power response. Um, it just, it's not quieter, but it just... I don't know, just idles is maybe ever so better. It just seems just better. Um, and that's when I put that fuel cleaner in. Um, so judging just by what the fuel cleaner did, um, like the fuel injector cleaner, I'm just going to go ahead and say that these really do work. Um, these are really great for your truck. Now, I have seen videos of people with bad injectors. They add this in, and within like 30 miles, 20 miles, you know, their truck starts up no problem. They have no issues with their injectors. So... Um, I'd say it works pretty good. I think it's worth the price. I mean, it's it's not that expensive. I mean, I guess the fuel one kind of gets expensive after a while, adding fuel all the time. Um, the way that I do it, here's my used one. But what I do is I don't ever fill up my tank. I usually do about half a tank and fill it up. So every other fill up, I just, you know, put this in. I don't put it in every single time I put gas in. I usually do it, like I said, like every other. So that's just what I've been doing. I haven't really noticed any fuel economy gains, nothing like that. Um, I haven't really noticed that the truck runs better, but like I said, I never used it, you know, I never like drove the truck without using it, so I really wouldn't know. Um, but from what I've seen, all the tests and stuff, I feel like it's a good product to use. I would definitely use um, the Arch Oil. I recommend it. I don't think it's that expensive. Um, I got, last time I bought it, I bought the three kit. I got this, the oil additive, and then the fuel ejector cleaner. I did that again, so I ran that injector cleaner twice through my truck. Um, came out to like 90 bucks 
I mean, yeah, 90 bucks, it is kind of expensive, but you know what? It, I don't think it's that bad, especially if you're going to keep your injectors going. Um, you know, the injectors and in those can definitely be faulty, especially being a high-pressure oil system. So, I don't know. I recommend the Arch Oil. Um, I definitely think it's worth it. I think the proof is in the pudding, and you see plenty of videos of people using this stuff, and it's making their truck run night and day. So, even if your injectors are, are, are bad... I would definitely try to run it to save your injector before you buy injectors. Um, and if your injectors are running fine, then I would definitely use that to keep them operating 100%. So, um, I don't know, this is my, my quick little video on the Arch Oil. Sorry for the lack of videos recently, I just really haven't had time to do, do too much. Still waiting for my Jeep, you know, once I get my Jeep back, I'm going to have a bunch of Jeep videos. Um, but yeah, I just haven't really had too much time. Not really too much even really to talk about, to be honest with you. Um, that's pretty much it. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.